hello welcome to my channel if you are a Joomla administrator this is for you Joomla admins this is an error message which uh, you may sometimes encounter with your Joomla administration this error is normally caused by installation of new plugins or extensions. This error is able to seize your Joomla administration or administrator uh, login. So you are unable to log into your Joomla administrator to do any correction. To resolve this problem, you have to go into your domain C panel and locate file manager. File manager from your domain your domain C panel. My domain my domain dot com slash C panel. So, uh, when you enter my domain, that is your domain, your domain, just want you to understand your domain, cpanel.com, uh, cpanel, uh, you enter and uh, you can look for file manager, public HTML folder. public HTML folder okay so as public public HTML HTML public HTML folder when you locate your public HTML folder you will have to find a uh, directory in which you installed your Joomla uh, Joomla will be installed directly in the root directory directory or could be installed in the folder that you created yourself during the installation, if you type uh, uh, a folder uh, a directory name in the directory box, it means that you have chosen a directory name and you have to find your directory that you installed your Joomla. If it is not installed in a directory, then you will have to uh, do what we are coming to do in the root directory of the public HTML folder of your site so from here if it's uh, if I've installed my uh, Joomla in the root directory then I will look for the folder called system the same applies if you were to install it in uh, on a, on a, on a, another directory Okay, so you look for the system directory, then from the system directory, you will find all the extensions that you have installed into your Joomla after the Joomla installation. Um, these extensions could be models or plugins or whatsoever they are. Uh, try and look for the most current uh, one that you have installed and activated which might have caused the, the error message. When you find your suspected um, directory that contains the um, extension that you installed, delete the entire directory from your system directory. If you do, check and see if your website loads. If your website did not load and it still produces the error message, then you will still have to go back into the system directory and locate another extension that might be causing your problem. You can delete any extension that uh, you feel like might be causing the problem or 
it's actually not playing any important role on your site you can delete all extensions could be deleted and you can come back and reinstall them just take a note of the extensions that you installed yourself after the installation of the Joomla and uninstall or remove, I mean delete the directories that belongs to those uh, extensions. If you do, definitely it will solve your problem. You don't have to um, reinstall your website uh, or clone your website uh, or um, what will I say? And you don't have to do any of those things, cloning your website, transferring, backing up. It's good to back up your website, yes, but uh, this is the major issue with this particular error. Something might have occurred uh, that you just did that might trigger this particular error. Class J request not found whatsoever it is. You, you, Something might have happened that you have done yourself that might have triggered it. So you can go into your cPanel, file manager, public, HTML folder and locate your 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 root, which is, if it's in your root file, if it's not in your root, if it's in an additional, add another directory, then you can locate that directory and find the system folder, which is very important, and you can find the uh, the extensions that you have installed there, directories will definitely be there. You can delete entirely the directory that you suspect that might be causing the issue. If you select the directory, just click on delete in your C panel and you have resolved your problem. Thank you very much. And uh, to add to that, please subscribe to my channel and uh, to motivate me to produce more of this. Uh, the less you subscribe, the less. Uh, I won't be motivated to do more. Uh, the more you subscribe, the more I'll be motivated to do more. I'll be subscribe. Thank you.